just then just shoot projectiles freely. Yes, that's very true. That's a good point. But you can see immediately, like normally he start off games just by shooting the bombs, and he he can't do that. So instead, he's choosing to use the forward air. Yo, is this briefcase pink? Uh, I think it might be the, 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 stage. the <laughs> evening sun <laughs> as we relax here on Smashville. Oh, but lovely. <laughs> <laughs> we have um, Dion has a little bit I of lead from I believe that's a full bucket already. Set. Look at that flash. Oh! Wait, what? He actually gets inked. <laughs> I I, seen I've that never seen that before. <laughs> uh, Bobby going far off stage. Oh, he tries to get the berry. able to cover oh, the bacon as well. You can see how rough this matchup looked already. Goodness. But Dion is keeping it even despite that big string from Bobby. But you, you see how careful he's got to be with every move he uses. Oh, and the bacon and the sausages, yeah. the neutral B stuffing out the projectiles that you can stuff out. I'd say it's actually a little bit of an interesting interaction that the bucket reflects the bombs rather than absorbing them because they have to explode. Ah, they yes. have to hit something before yeah, they yeah. can actually blow up. So it's a little bit unfortunate for Bobby that he's tried to fill up his bucket and he's just knocking away these bombs. <laughs> yeah. Actually, it's Dion taking the first stock right now. Yeah, with that up tilt just about covering the platform. Perfect height. Oh, tries to get him. Okay, but the missile will fill up the bucket, and I think because of how strong that missile is, he's going to get a very strong bucket off it as well. For those of you that don't know, uh, the way Game Watch's bucket works is it takes all the moves that add, uh, are put in it, adds them together, times it by, I think, 1.2, but a multiplier, and then <laughs> turns it into the big bucket. Into the big bucket. <laughs> and Which is frame two, and it covers half the stage. So... You don't really want to fill up that bucket when no. you have the chance. <laughs> Not at all. That quick down tilt. There it is. He has a bucket now, though. Which does mean that Dion is able to just shoot projectiles. Because true. there's nothing more to fill up. I feel like he'll yeah. probably want to save this bucket for next stock, too. So he might be able to shoot a bit more. But that said, how else is this game watch getting in versus this wall? Yeah, that's true. Oh, he tries to go in. With the down air. Okay, so he's down now air. got a chunky old bucket. It had a stealth missile in it, which is going to do extra damage. It gets the ground down, down throw into yeah. bucket. Oh, no, no. Down throw into Nan's up air. Never mind. <laughs> doesn't even want to shoot the bucket. Now that he's off stage, now that he's got nowhere to go, I think we're going to see it come out. Oh, it has a regrab, re I think. Regrab, down smash, sending him upwards. Ooh. Game Watch not ready to cover that stealth missile. Ah. <laughs> Very smart. Dashing in the bucket. There was nowhere to go. I'm sure that would have broken his shield had he chosen not to do it. Ooh. Speaking of Nearly. not shielding. Wow, oh. the active frames and Jeez. Game Watch is exploitable two frame coming in here. <laughs> Weaving really? under there, but it didn't matter. Yeah. That's that coming That's in. That's the thing. You're not just trying to avoid the projectiles. You're trying to avoid the normals that Gunner has once you get in. Nice. Which Game Watch, uh, Bobby is not quite aware of right now. And Dion is able to force Game Watch to come into a very specific mm. point and then just hit him with a normal. I like how it, like he uh, reflected, geez, uh, yeah. reflected the tiny bomb, but he's still down tilted or whatever it was. The uh, the reflection in hitbox Excellent. animation. Excellent ledge trapping coming out from Bowlby. Jeez. Yeah, despite what I just said, he's uh, got a really nice lead for himself and a lot of momentum. And over commitment. Up be out shield. Probably could have got a bigger punish on that dash attack, but taking it safe. Yeah, and you can't punish that, my guy. Still on the ledge. How does Gunner get off? Whoa. With a big old dash attack, apparently. Oh, trying to play around Bowlby's. Little zone there in yeah. the mid range. And I don't think he's got any charge on his bucket right now, so Dion can maybe shoot a projectile or two just because he knows it's not going to completely fill the bucket. He's just using a lot more normals as a stealth bomb, though. Yeah. Dion yeah. sort of running up close, trying to bait some sort of uh, overcommitment from Bulby, but he's. Uh, the thing is, that there's not so much thing as an overcommitment when yeah. you have that up B, because <laughs> he just kind of ignores any situation. Yeah. You're right. Able to get down. Whoa. Wow. It looked like he dropped shield for a I second know. there. <laughs> and then realized, oh, wait, this move goes on forever. <laughs> <laughs> that was very funky. He's lucky he was good shield again. Yeah. Bobby just waiting for um, actually Dion to overcommit. He's weaving around the bombs fairly well, although as we say that, he's now getting forced off stage by the bombs. The up air out. Catch. That's going to do it. Nice. Excellent. Such a long vertical hitbox. Mm. And that's the thing, Dion's always can try to condition that jump, or I believe that was even an up B, but he's always trying to condition you to get into yeah, the air. Yeah, that's the thing, Game & Watch, we saw it against Pelly, they love, 
Love up the, the love of being. They like going high. They don't like being on the stage. And that up air is more than enough to uh, cover that vertical space where game watches like to be sometimes, for a lot of the time. Very nice stuff to Dion. So despite it being a very, well, non-typical matchup, maybe not hard matchup, mm -hmm. but you can't play how you normally will. Yeah. Dion's still able to um, stuff out what oh, Bobby's trying to do. Straight away with the neutral peak. <laughs> It's going to be so much damage. This neutral air does so much damage. He's a 67%. Goodness gracious me. And, that and a bucket. Yeah. Ouch. Uh, yeah. He just reacted to that, like, a staff on that missile. So that's also interesting grenade. is that the, the, the down B grenade is a multi-hit. And mm. so it's only filling up the bucket with tiny little hits. And right. so uh, the final bucket is not actually that strong. Gotcha. That bucket only did 16%. There it is again. Okay, so it's a 16% bucket. It doesn't seem to kill until very late. Ooh. But it's still just... A quick, huge disjoint that uh, Game Watch can use yes, when, whenever Dion overcommits or even just kind of presses slightly the wrong button. One confirm that you can also see is up B into bucket. That is the thing that Game Watch oh, can really? do. Oh, really? Yeah. Huh. But we're not going to see um, Dion actually get hit by too many up Bs. We saw it a bit in Game 1. But <laughs> We've also seen that Dion understands the counterplay to the bombs. So whenever Bulby's reflecting them, Ooh. he's just immediately hitting them. Which is what you need to do yeah. versus those bombs. Jeez, nearly taking out does the back air. Stealth bomb gonna eliminate any sausage pressure. <laughs> and bacon. <laughs> Such a funny term. Things you can only say in Smash. Yeah. Dion's actually doing, he's changed up how he recovers a bit. He's not doing these upbeats onto stage that he would Ooh. normally do. That dash attack almost sealing it out. Nice reaction from well. Bulby. Yeah. That's the kind of side B that you... you oh, nice the landing. smash. That's, That's definitely going to defuse that bomb and <laughs> Bulby's stock. <laughs> nice, nice F smash. These dash attacks are covering so much range and there's a really good burst option for Dion as we see him land yeah. another one. Ooh, down <laughs> tilt, able to low profile under the grenade. See, just Dion obviously has got a very good understanding of just how neutral works besides playing me gunner. Like the way he's moving around um, and cooling out jumps is so good that you you could see him playing any like yeah. you could see him playing like cloud or something, and he'd be um, he'd be placing hitboxes in the exact right place. Oh yeah. For sure, for sure. Ooh, oh, but that is a miss input and a half, but he makes it to ledge. No punish from Bulby. That is unfortunate. 175%. Oh, Lingering hitbox. Yeah. Just about catching but that but toe of me, Gunner. It, the deaths were about a minute apart, but Bulby took very, very few percent in that time. So. Yeah, he's at, he's at a not too bad 61% yeah, right yeah. now. <laughs> oh, okay. the bomb. <laughs> And out that aerial he's, yeah, he's really stopping Bulby in the air. Bulby still has a bucket, by the way. He does, yeah. But he just hasn't got a chance to use it. There, there it is. we go. That Jeez. one did all the damage. That could be really what he needed to get back into this game, actually. Tries to catch wow. a jump. None of the active hitboxes able to catch that neutral get up. A little bit of a clank, but he gets a grab out of he's it anyway. He's choosing to get off stage. This could be really bad for Dion. Again, the bacon. Barely missing. The Up call out smash. on the spot dodge. Again, and he's and that's a reflector bomb, so that's going to do more damage. But <laughs> really, he just needs to fill it with a stealth missile. None of the other buckets are that strong. Mm. Oh my goodness! Interesting choice from Dion <laughs> to try and S smash a game watch up smash, but <laughs> like sometimes you you uh, find the me gunners they just F smash like sort of in a. As a sort of get off me because yeah. it's such a wide range, but it's well, when sort you're that close. close, yeah. Wow, wow. reading the roll on the up tilt, able to clip that smashable platform and landing him the kill. So we are even last stop right now. These Nair's doing a lot of work for Dion. Wow, so normally you think they get a guaranteed grab there, but apparently not quite guaranteed because Game Watch able to up be out of that pressure. Mm, just a bit too slow. Bomb in the bomb. <laughs> okay, oh, yeah, I got a, a bucket attack. charge off that as well. I oh, believe. He, oh, he read the panic up B. Didn't quite get the up smash though. Yeah, thing is, you can read that up B and still just sometimes not cover it because of the low landing lag and he has so much control over where he is able to drift. You're not parrying game. Watch back here, man. Yeah, and reflecting these bombs. 
the up tilt doing a lot of work for Dion in this game. Just clipping Game Watch on that platform. Ooh, Ooh punishing the bucket. Yeah. Nice little effort. He has got two charges on the bucket, only needs one more right Ooh, now. Ooh, quick down till that down smash could have been real dangerous mm, for Dion. Might have been death, I'm gonna be honest. That down smash into S smash, very powerful. <laughs> yeah, but he's not able to, he's able to dash tag when Bobby reflects the neutral B grenade, but not the down green grenade. Not, oh, the, man. not that black grenade. No. Okay, that is a full charge. This is suddenly very scary. Well, I don't think he's got anything too strong in the bucket, so I don't think Dion is at risk of dying now. Oh, oh a no, bit of a weird interaction with the bomb. I believe. <laughs> but yeah, I think that only did about 20%, so it's not as scary Catch as it attack. looks. What is scary is oh. how big that hitbox was. <laughs> Catching the drift back with that dash attack. Very nice stuff to Dion. Just about closing that game. And who would have thought it? Dion, I mean, everyone knows he's good. Everyone knows he's really good, but he, he never really does too amazing at big events. Like, obviously, he had his run at Syndicate where he beat Mr. R, but then he lost to um, a couple of other very strong European players, but yeah. he placed around 65th, I want to say, which is good, but it's compared to the caliber of some of the players we got right here. Yeah, he, he, might, he might place higher, but I, I can't remember. Um, but you're right, you're right. Uh, He's not had the best UK showings. Yeah, and then B is really strong. But at the moment, Bobby looking a little bit lost. He's maybe kind of collecting his thoughts a little bit. Mm. How he's going to counter this uh, gunner? Because it's interesting that although you think bucket is a big factor, in a way it's not because it's not actually doing that much damage and it's taking no. him a long time to build up the charge. He's landing maybe two or three buckets per game when they're doing 20% and not killing. Yeah. It's not as scary as it sounds. Yeah, it's only really the bucketed stealth bomb that's yeah. uh, there scary we, bucket. Uh, there's the guaranteed grab that we thought we were going to see before. Spot dodge. Choosing the fair. Ah, oh, tries to get a nice uh, little conversion. You can get some very cool combos off that fair. Wow, <laughs> the pressure applied from Bolby right now. Forcing the jump, ready to catch it. And he's recognized, he's able to react so close. That could be really bad for Dion. I believe Bolby could have just gone up and grabbed him because he that he owned that grenade right there because he reflected it. Uh, yeah, he could have actually, yeah. But it felt like he was scared or he thought Dion was going to roll away from the grenade or himself. Or hit the grenade or yeah. something, yeah. But either way, uh, Bolby in a very good spot right now. Tries to get a stealth bomb. He's actually missing the stealth bomb now. The active frames. Yeah. <laughs> Detonating early, realizing that that was not a good idea. Neither is getting up into that chair yet again. Big lead for Bolby in this game three, and this is exactly what he needs to make. Start making this comeback. Wow! And now he's got a lead. He's saying, "Don't, I, I don't approach anymore." Yeah. Oh, oh wow! He he that actually, move. went over the bucket. Yeah, you can see Bolby's complaining completely non-committal. He's happy to be on the other side of the stage. Because why would he approach, to be honest? Yeah. And he's started to recognize that um, Dion loves to dash tuck after he's placing a bomb that he thinks is going to get reflected. So it's uh, kind of a second state of adaption right now. Great. Jump. Dion's been jumping out of pressure a little bit too much. Game uh, Bobby is capitalizing so well. And Game Watch, once he gets in there, that's big combos. Yeah, nice juicy 44% yeah. on him. This is the first game in this set that has looked very one-sided. Bobby somehow just figured it out a little bit, able to just put a little bit more pressure onto Dion, um, get a little bit more once he's in advantage as well, but the up tilt again, being one of the most important moves for Dion in this set. Ooh, a, lot, a little bit of a dash back there. Dashing forward, trying to catch an overextension. And suddenly they're just playing a ground game. They're not interested in either projectile. They're, they're just using their normals, trying to feed each other out. Ooh, not quite. By big, big ceilings on battlefield. Simple up B punish. Chasing him into the air. Uh, there's one thing about battlefield that it gives a lot of options for Dion to retreat to with his up B because he has so much control over where he can land with it. And just go going to the top platform there. Oh, yeah. I like that Dion is now exploding his stealth missile early when he recognizes that Bobby could be pulling the bucket. 
Oh, little Ooh, tiny shield. Rolling away from that pressure. It looked like Dion was in a really bad spot, but Bobby just kind of gave it up. Oh, and you can't be shielding that. Free grabs. <laughs> you get a grab. You get a grab. <laughs> How do you come for landing the oh, Optil again? Up the patience from Dior knowing that a defensive option was gonna come out from Bulby. Oh, his dash attack coming in for Bulby. Oh, and he's oh, slightly below the ledge. B. This is a real struggle. How is he getting out of this pressure? Game Watch F-Tilt coming out before Gunner F-Tilt. They're still bomb finally getting him off, but he still gets hit by the bacon. <laughs> Such a struggle for Dion right now. That racks up a lot of percentage. Yeah, he's 133. When did this happen? Oh, <laughs> gets the wrong hit on the up tilt. The down down air. air. Gonna do it. Big, big lead for Bulby right Catches now. Catches Dion trying to catch him in the air. Yeah, that is a very healthy lead for Bulby right now. Just sort of circling the platforms. Running away, but also sort of a... Uh, yeah, he, he goes in a little bit with the neutral air, trying to catch a jump. So he's not totally non-committal. Yeah, but I think I think that's exactly right because especially at zero percent, you are looking for that neutral air because it can lead to fifty yes. percent so easily. So if you can just land it, that's worth the slight risk you're taking by approaching. But everything else, ooh, choosing to decimate early again, recognizing the deal. Uh, Bobby has not been pressing a button. Uptil has been so good. It's the one it really time has. W whenever Bobby's using up B. Oh, he's trying to <laughs> Wow, just able to get a grab, and Bobby knows he can get big damage. Oh, Slight misses quiet. out the combo. That's a little bit unfortunate. I think it was good DI from Dion, though. Yeah. Mixing it up. Double up here. Yeah, you're never going to die to that unless Air you're on Jigglypuff. But <laughs> just about clips from the nose of that turtle. <laughs> oh. Again, the bait from Bobby. He actually held the bucket from a little bit longer, forcing Dion. <laughs> he really wanted to dash hack into him, but Bobby knew that. Really smart play coming out. That could be a full Ooh, bucket, not quite. Actually drifting upwards a little bit of the bucket. But uh, Dion's been doing a really good job of catching Bobby coming down with his downers with the up tilts. Um, and Bobby's still continuing to do these downers. A little bit risky. It's the one time that he's really getting caught out. Okay, recovering super low. Oh, oh he, he falls out the there. Ah. Didn't quite place it in the right That's spot. really though. rough for Dion. Yeah. He like barely tickled that hitbox and yeah. just fell straight back out. Just hit him with like the actual gun rather than <laughs> any of the bullets. Just kind of slap Game Watch on the head a little bit. To be fair, getting hit by a gun would hurt. It would, it would. <laughs> or a briefcase as it is in this case. <laughs> True. Okay, he grabs the ledge that not I'm not quite doing it. Yeah, the big blast zones and there's the full bucket. I mean if you're living till 170 as Game Watch, you're doing something right. Yeah. <laughs> Very light character. Down smash? No, you just try to go for a quicker down tilt. But there's really? a bucket. He had the stealth bomb bucket. I, All right. I don't remember him bucking a stealth bomb, but he must have because, as we've seen, nothing else does yeah, yeah. anything. All right, so Bulby uh, one game into making a reverse 3 0 in which he must make to uh, win this set and carry on with the bracket. Dion very quickly going to light up Cruz. Um, I guess he wants a smaller stage where he can just control all of the stage with his bombs, whereas you can see on Battlefield, Bobby was able to sit on one side of the stage and there wasn't much that Dion could do about mm. it. Because that is one thing about Gunner, is that his projectiles are great, yeah. but they don't go that far. No. Besides the stealth bomb, there's, yeah, there's which is bomb. normally Dion's answer to someone standing on the other side of the stage. Yeah. <laughs> but as we've seen, that is the one projectile that he really just can't throw out willy-nilly. Like, he yeah. has to be so thoughtful when he's using that stealth bomb. All right, off to Lila. Game four. Oh, calling out the jump. Here we go. Big damage coming out for Game Watch. Not quite landing them there. Unfortunate. <laughs> Funny little interaction there. Gets one little charge of... Um, Bomb. Actually, I do wonder if, if you're able to bucket the final hit of the down B grenade, then it makes the bucket stronger because Maybe, that yeah. is a big hit. Whereas instead of bucketing Ooh. the multi hit. Quick down tilt. Now, there's one thing uh, Gunner is able to pressure quite, the platforms quite well with up air and up tilt, but there's quite a lot of lag afterwards, so you, your opponent is able to escape. In yeah, you're right. Oh. Whoa! Was that iframes on like 
getting, yeah, getting when the you bucket, bucket you yeah. do have iframes, that is correct. It's nuts. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I think oh, I heard he, the bucket he released sound. it, yeah, and I don't think that was going to hit even if he hadn't got interrupted. So, actually, that's crazy because bucket is frame two or three or something, so he, we didn't even see it come out. <laughs> so that must have been like a frame perfect hit. That's I really, know, really yeah, funny yeah. thing. That could be very costly. Yeah. All these dash tags, expecting the spot dodge. Dian not giving it to him. Back air. Instead, giving him a back air. Holding his nerve there with the shield <laughs> while that down smash was on. Not uh, losing his lead that he's built up so well now. Ooh. Oh, he's going to be good be right out of there. Yeah. <laughs> if you overcommit, you can just react and go over them. It's yeah. very strong up B just for movement purposes. The F tilt just does a nice little get off the option. Ooh, doesn't quite punish that. Bobby on a bit of a chase right now, though. Yeah, I mean, it's the situations in these slow matchups, which we've seen quite a few times in this top eight already, where when one character gets a lead, they're very content to just stay back and say, you have to come to me. I have the lead right now. Bobby reading that stealth bomber, by the way, getting it into his bucket. Quite getting the wow, side the tilt. mix up. And I think that was going to shield poke, even if um, Dion hand drop shield. So I really like that back air coming out from Bobby. But the affair not quite connecting. Does have oh, quite wonky hit boxes. Yeah, that Alpha stays out forever. Back throw just to get him off stage. Ooh. Put the grenade into the bit of a reversal. Yeah. That was a really sketchy situation for the Bulby right now. And Dion really looking for that up tilt. Knows that he can get a lot of its early kills with that up tilt. It kills very early. Oh. The down B grenade almost sending Dion uh, Bulby right into the blast zone. And that oh, one oh, will do it. Bucket did one, got hit by the other, and yeah. now get a, got hit by third. And this could be Bowlby falling out of the tournament at seventh place right now. 2-1 down in loser's eights versus a me gunner that is shrinking the screen. <laughs> it's all over. Okay. Right. You gonna shoot some bacon? No. Look at the concentration on both players' faces, by the way. <laughs> now, now that we get to see it. <laughs> up, B. The, up B into the blast zone. <laughs> and Game Watch still just <clears throat> playing the slowest game. In fact, Bowlby is, even though he's so far behind, he's choosing to enlarge the screen. <laughs> 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 but it feels like Bowlby's still the one camping, which is so weird to see when you're stopped behind. Mm. But the back air out of shield, big punish. F smash, smash is not quite going to do it. So strong in this game, yeah. though. One more hit, and Dion will be moving on. Bobby's got to figure it out that right now. Looking close. He's getting trapped on the oh, ledge. Oh, he had the read, but not oh. the positioning. That's the worst feeling when you know the roll's coming and you don't quite cover it. But that is one more lease of life for Bobby. Boy, is he going to make air. the most of it? Still got a long way to climb back. Even Dion's just pestering him with little forward airs. Ooh, the slight cross up. Ooh, that up air was so nice, covering so much space. Almost getting the back air into the blast zone. The oh, down air below ledge, uh, below platform. The platform. Exactly. <laughs> Reflection. Bobby building up ahead of steam. Still got a long way to go. The Ooh. bucket was not wise when he was up being straight into him. That's a punish by Dion. Up air, catches the jump. That'll be it for that. 3-1 to Dion, moving on into loser's quarters over Bowlby. Bowlby 